All right, everybody, welcome back to another Swamp Stalker Outdoors video. And this week, I'm reviewing this little sucker right here. Get it, little sucker? <laughs> All right, no playing around. But anyways, now if you uh, watched my last video where we went to the Outdoor Life Field and Stream Expo, you know what this is. If you didn't, you're going to want to go and check it out. It's a pretty good video, and uh, I appreciate everybody who did watch it. And, and uh, I just want to do a little review on this. So, you know, I just I want to do some different videos, but I just can't get out. You know, no fishing. It's just been the weather's been nasty and just, you know, just can't do it. So I'm going to do another review this week and I hope you guys enjoy it. So let's get started. Here we go. All right, so this is uh, one of the products that we checked out while we was over there at the Outdoor Life Field and Stream Expo, and I thought it was pretty neat, and I want to share it with you guys. So when we was over there, you know, we came across this, and uh, the guy did a little demonstration, and and uh, he used a five-gallon bucket lid. Now I thought this would be a great idea for you know a lot of fishermen that you know you go you're gonna go fishing, and and if you're using live bait, you got a five-gallon bucket with you. You know, so you can always put your flat lid on the top and basically it's got to have a nice smooth surface. So what I'm going to use today is I'm going to use this stainless steel. It's a lid for a pot. So, but you can use anything. You can put this on anything that has a flat, smooth surface. So basically what you do is I'm going to use this Mountain Dew as an example. You take, take this little, little sucker, get it, <laughs> but I'm going to put it on here and you just fold it up on there like that and then you flip it over and you get it to where it's, it's right on the edge just like that hope you can see that in the video here but you take it like that now look this is unopened so this is basically this is going to be my flat surface you take it see if i can do this one-handed and you put it on the surface just like that can you all see that so you got a little lip around your can. Make sure I got it on here good. Kind of hard to do it with uh, one hand, but you get it, get it on there like I said. Around your can, put it on your surface, and then voila! Look at that. That thing is on there now. It's stuck. Look, I can barely pull it. I can barely get that thing off of there. I mean, this thing works great. But like I was saying, you know, if you fish live bait and you got that flat, you know, flat uh, five gallon bucket lid and you put it on, put your soda on there and, you know, or, or you know what? I tell you what, look what else I got here. Not just Mountain Dew, but I don't get sponsored by these people either. I don't get sponsored by Mountain Dew, but I wish I did. Now I know a lot of you got this. Hey, we'll try this. So like I said, you take it, you stretch it over there and you notice it's nice and tight around the edge of the can and it's nice and tight around this this thing stretches this is a neoprene so you get get that on there take your stainless steel lid see if I can do it hold it and show you got it on there see it's all the way around there got a lip all the way around the edge of your cup Look at that. Don't come off. I mean, it's stout now. But so what you do is when you, you got your lid there, say you wanna take a drink, you just peel the lid up, peel that little rubber, peel that little sucker up and pull it off. You wanna put it back down? That's it. Look at that. Don't come off. Now this will work great, you know, if you got a boat that's got a, a flat center console, you know, the top of it, I'm telling you, you can ride across the water and this thing is not going to come off. I just thought it was a pretty neat little, uh, little product, but let's test it a little further, shall we? All right. It's plastic. Well, I guess it's got a plastic coating on the outside, but it's aluminum. So let's try it on the plastic. All right, got it up there. So then you're gonna want to pull it down. So this one's kind of nice. You got you got that line right there, so you can just kind of line it up. Let's see if I can do it here. One, yeah, there we go. And then 
flip it over. All right, so that's on there pretty good, right? But I'm gonna take it a step further. Let's open this bad boy up. Now this is a pretty good container, right? Let's take a bottle of water and put in it. All right, let me open it up. It's great now I got stuff on the table. I keep hitting the lid making all this noise. All right, so that ought to add some weight to it, right? I mean, can't test a product without having liquids, making it a little heavier. But I'll tell you what, not just one, let's do two. I don't think we can get two in this container, but you get the point. Fill it up. So basically, I got one, little, little, little over one, almost one and a half. Now, yeah, I'm gonna make a mess everywhere. Oh well. Let me just fix this real quick. Now I'm all wet. Let's try it. Got, I mean, look at it. It's got water all over it. Test and see if it's got water. You know, if, the, if it'll affect it with water. I don't know. I haven't tried it yet. Got it on there. Look at that. No effect whatsoever. And that thing is soaking wet. Look, you see all the water on it and the water drops? Neoprene's wet too. Let's see if I can get it off. Oh, you see that? It's on there pretty tight. Put it back on there, no problem. Wanna take it off? Look, easy, nothing to it. Sticks right to it, peel it off, comes right up, put it back. So, like I said, you know, it was just a cool product. I thought you guys would enjoy it. I mean, you can't, that thing works good. This little sucker's awesome. <laughs> All right, everybody, so I hope you enjoyed this video. Now go over and check out Little Sucker. <laughs> every time, I laugh every time I say it. But anyways, remember to hit the thumbs up button for me. Subscribe if you're not subscribed, and if you are, I greatly appreciate it. And we'll catch you guys on the next adventure. Bye, y'all. Wait, 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 wait a minute. I almost forgot. I'm going to give away this little sucker. So if you want my little sucker, hold on. That didn't sound right, did it? If you want this little sucker, then you need to be subscribed to my channel. Nah, I got to be able to see that you're subscribed, so make sure that I can see it. Like this video and leave me a comment down below saying that you want my little sucker. If you do those three things and you're from the U.S. or Canada, I'm going to mail this out to one of you lucky subscribers. So thanks for watching, and we'll see you on our next adventure. Good luck, everybody. Bye, y'all.